Hey YouTube, here's Heiko, I'm in my garage and we're going to take a quick video about my 1974 R90 BMW motorcycle uh, which has a little bit of a problem and uh, maybe one of you guys can help me out solve the problem. Uh, I just discovered a oil leak from a location and um, I don't know exactly what to do about it but I know there are a lot of BMW airhead expert out there among you guys um, so if you have any idea, please uh, leave a comment uh, and, and help me out, please. I'm going to flip cameras around and then show you what I'm talking about, okay? All right, there she is. Now I'm going to show you uh, what's going on here. Over the last uh, few months, I've noticed a, you know, it's not a massive oil leak. It's usually like one or two drops on the ground after I parked the motorcycle and um, I've already done some cleanup and trying to isolate where it's coming from. It looked like there was a little bit of a oil pan gasket leak so I just went ahead, removed the oil pan, put in a new gasket, cleaned up everything, um, cleaned the strainer, retorqued some bolts and uh, then was done with that. Then it looked like it was actually a push rod tube seal under the cylinder here, which I'm going to show you here in a second. And um, I know that those seals are all relatively new, so it's not old rubber that's kind of hard. So I kind of jiggled the, the seal a little bit in its location, uh, pushed it a little bit, and it seems to be holding oil without leaking. There might be a very slow seep, but I'm not in a hurry to do anything about it. But the actual dripping leak that I have that leaves a drop or two of oil every day, I park it, is from a location which I really have no idea what to do about it. So let me turn on some lights here. I'll show you. So the two leaks that I suspected, which are not really leaks, so down here you see this um, push rod tube seal looks a little moist but even after riding it for an hour there's nothing coming out it's just a little sweating so that is really a leak that i will ignore then as i said i did the oil pen gasket already freshly retorked stainless steel bolts put um, anti-seize on all the bolts so that they will not seize up in in the cast aluminum but then now today i did a really thorough cleanup job and i found where the oil is coming out um, so just to give you a perspective here this is the left side motorcycle right under the carburetor where the shift lever is um, the engine has a little bit of a shelf down here and um, i know if i would have a rear main seal leak i would find oil on that shelf down there but I actually have a leak out of this weird looking, um, let's see if I can get my finger in there, that thing. Someone must have smeared some glue or uh, epoxy over that to seal it off. And this is where the oil is coming from. So I had this all cleaned up with degreaser. And if I swipe my finger, oh my goodness, can't even get there. So it's a hard to, hard to analyze situation if you don't know where the oil is from. There's the oil on my finger. It's coming from that opening. I know that here in the engine block, there are a couple uh, plugs from back in the days when they drilled the oil passages, the oil galleys. So there's one right over here. Uh, looks like a flathead screw head, really. And uh, back here, there's supposed to be one as well. And I guess it was leaking and the previous owner just smeared some epoxy over it. And I guess that broke loose and now it's leaking. And uh, now my question, do you guys know a easy way to fix this? Um, is this just a plug with a thread and I can put some thread sealant on it and be done with it? Or what do I need to do? Do you guys have any idea? Please leave comments. I'll post this video also on Facebook. So if you have any ideas, uh, write me a comment or a message even uh, what I should do about this. 
Uh, I'm definitely not just going to take the epoxy out and smear some new on it. I probably will try to get that original plug out of there. I don't even know if there's still a plug under there. And then we'll try to seal that off properly. All right, guys. Uh, thanks for watching this. If you have any idea what to do about it, please let me know. Thank you. Take care. Bye.